Watch out. This morning, there he is. A family overjoyed after a rescue that can only be described as a miracle. The family jumping for joy after spotting him holding on to buoys, bringing him to safety alive. Oh my God. <laughs> the 22 year old diver who has years of experience spearfishing spent hours alone at sea after being pulled by a powerful current off Key West, leaving his fellow divers behind. As the Coast Guard searched, so did his family and a friend. I was pretty positive that he was, you know, he was out there treading water, swimming around somewhere. The sun quickly setting as they went to Dylan's last known location, and then this. You can see and feel their relief. The Coast Guard says it searched from the surface and the air for more than three hours before Dylan was found. So yeah, as I had seen the sun disappear, I knew things were starting to get a little more dire at that time. I had just seen a reef shark swim past me. The Coast Guard adding that most missing diver cases do not have a positive outcome like this one. They were in the right place at the right time. Dylan cut weights off his wetsuit and used a piece of bamboo to stay afloat before creating a raft with buoys big enough to help him get spotted. And they would have came and found me eventually, but uh, by some miracle, my parents and everybody else on board, my grandfather's boat had ended up driving and basically landing right on top of me, which was uh, nice. The Coast Guard brought Dylan back to the station and besides being a little cold, he was just fine. They say his wetsuit helped keep him warm and able to withstand all of the elements. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.